enjoyable part of your job, I'm sure there's many. There's a lot, actually it's the job itself. I mean, uh, from my CV, some of you understand uh, the motorcycle um, development is in my genetic code. Now it's in, in everybody's DNA of this team. So um, being part of that uh, uh, is, is just fantastic. I never wake up in the morning and say, what do I do today? I mean, I never switch off my brain for that. Is uh, This is our passion, what we go for now. We, we never stop working, really. No, this is somewhat, let's say, the, the borderline because I have a private life as well. Uh, I have a fantastic family of three children and a wife, but they, they somewhat know me, no? so I really never switch off my brain. So I used to have a habit like uh, I have a piece of paper next to my bed because it's the most weird part of it. If you wake up in the night, you say, I got the solution, and in the morning, you're, you're somewhat lost the memory. So I write it down, and uh, yeah, we're, we're always on gas. How important has it been to have riders with proven development skills such as the likes of Troy Corsa um, when associated with the development of the RR project? It's absolutely fundamental for the R&D to have uh, riders being capable to give some certain feedback. Let's say the, the language of a rider is uh, what he is uh, really reporting, what is his uh, feedback in terms of words, but especially also his gestures, everything. All the rider's feedback is uh, becoming a certain language, like he's saying when he's going on gas, he can do this and he cannot do this. And uh, it's so fundamental, his skill to bring back some information to the R&D.